What's going on, you guys? I'd like to welcome you guys to another DC TV Talk Part 2. I'm covering Black Lightning. I think it's episode 10 or 11. I don't know, but all I know it was a good ass fucking episode. This episode, Jefferson Pierce. Oh, matter of fact, last week, I didn't, my bad. Yeah, I gotta forgive me. I didn't finish because I, I missed like the last two minutes of Black Lightning and I didn't realize that until I seen the beginning of this one because it's all like stuff from last week where we showed the vice principal actually working with the ASF and I'm like I didn't fucking see that I didn't talk about that in my review why the fuck then I went back and looked at the record episode I'm like oh you had two minutes left that's why the fuck you didn't talk about it in your review I didn't even notice I guess the review was later or I just stopped watching I don't know what the fuck happened but either way girl the vice principal is a part of the ASF which is, is a big fucking deal because she's been working close to Jefferson Pierce this entire time and I, didn't, I just thought she just was digging it and kind of feeling it. I still think she is. You know what I'm saying? I think that's kind of why she did what she did and why she was like, you see, like the regret and, and, and the hesitation when she was had to do certain things. And this episode, <coughs> that we, she has to do more. It's like, yeah, you have to find out he's a black lightning. And you have black lightning working, uh, you have uh, uh, Anissa working on side of Gamby. And here's what I thought was gonna happen, and that I guess I guess I'm just apparently wrong. You know, I thought that when they they start teaming together, uh, and Black Lightning, they have to prove. And and Gam made a good point. No, we can't just break them out. We have to prove that he's not Black Lightning. And then you have Henderson helping him as well. But here's my thing: when when they was, I thought they were going to do something to like show like, oh, no, we, we got attacked last night. And the person who did the attack to use Lightning. That's why I thought they were going to use Jennifer to like show like, oh, they used Lightning. The lights went out and the person was using Lightning to attack us. I thought that's how they were going to uh, uh, bring Jennifer uh, into the fold. But that was how they did. Gabby just had to come up with a hologram that he was able to use. To, to get people to see Black Lightning while Jefferson Pierce in jail for being framed by the, 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 the vice principal. And I thought it was really good. I thought it was just dope to see him in jail and, and the, the, the him, because he got like an iron wheel. Because if it would have been me, I probably would have been out of it real quick because I probably would have broke out of jail because they was doing like some fucked up shit. And to me, I know I'm, I'm, I'm not going to jail. So, and I'm not just gonna sit here and I don't know. It could, What's, what's what's crazy and they, they take him into school uh, he had to uh, convince like Jennifer like you have to chill like, you can't just go crazy on these people even though what they're doing to me is wrong it's just a whole bunch of different shit and I think they implemented it very well in the episode uh, yeah it's, it's, that's pretty damn that's pretty much the whole episode but yeah I, I thought it was, everything was done well and I thought the way they told the story is is is, is I commend them on that, but the big thing for me coming out of this episode, one thing is that Gamby and Black Lightning are not back together, even though I thought if I was him, I still probably wouldn't trust Gamby, because Gamby pulled some shit for like 30 years, also I kind of wondered like what are they doing with the uh, with the uh, people they've been having for 30 years, like what, what are they doing with the bodies, you know, and what's their end goal with them, uh, that was another thing I, I, I was wondering. But the, but the biggest thing was like the, the preview for next week because you see Lala, you see Tobias, you see Black Light, and you see everybody seem to be going at it next week. And I don't think that's not even a season finale. So who knows what happens there. But yeah, this week was definitely a very good episode. I just, I just like the, 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 like the, the, the depth they gave each character and everything. And this is trying to uh, hold back. Jennifer trying to hold back. Black Light and holding back. Not wanting to just break out. Get the relationship they have with Gambit, they didn't really just go deep into it with the mother, and they didn't even I, they didn't even have anything going on with the villains. But instead, you have the corrupt cops, you have Anderson taking, trying to take down people in the system. It was one point where I really thought that Jefferson was gonna tell him like, "Yo, I'm Black Lightning," but he he had that information. Just like I just can't, I don't I don't know. I should probably at, at some point you gotta just wonder like, "Am can you trust Henderson?" Because Henderson has done some like some stuff to help you like, you wonder um, I think eventually Henderson will find out he's black like I don't know if it, I don't know if that happens in the comic or not I'm just going off what I see from the show and how 
they need stuff going on in the show. Other than that, very good episode. Very one of my favorite episodes of the season. I have to say, uh, like, comment, subscribe. Let me get. Let me know what you guys thought about that. Let me catch up with you guys later. I gotta head to the movies, man. I gotta go see Cock Blockers. I know it's called Blockers, but just be honest, it's a picture of a chicken right there. Damn block, cock block. Peace out.